name is Rona Dougal and it's my great pleasure to welcome you all to Scotland's Learning Disability Awards Virtual Spotlight Event 2020. This Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today I have a very big surprise for you guys. So me and Walid were nominated for Scottish Commission uh, Learning Disability Award and we and Walid have won that award due to our contribution to the community. So this award is given every year um, to one family, uh, family carer and their relative. And this is throughout the whole Scotland. So now, uh, well, each year, uh, the family carers uh, and the relatives have to go and attend the uh, attend the program there but this year due to coronavirus uh, they have sent us the um, uh, the awards so now i'm going to open the awards So this is the Scottish Learning Disability Award 2020. Family carers and their relative Shehzad and Walid Ahmad. So this is going to go up in Walid's room. Walid, do you like your award? Walid? Do you, like, uh, do you like your award? So there's uh, other awards as well in the package. Okay. Wow, this is a nice trophy. Oh, it's other way around. So, this is the certificate and this is the award. And this award especially for Walid because of his hard work and me and Walid making the YouTube videos for awareness to help other families and carers. So now I'm going to share the video with you of why the judges uh, picked me as the winner. It is my great pleasure to introduce Pat Graham, Chair of PAMIS, and Louise Morgan, Director at the Carers Trust Scotland, who are going to co-present the Family Carer and Their Relative Award. Over to you guys. Hello, my name's Pat Graham. I'm a family carer to my daughter Lauren, who has a profound learning disability, and I'm also the Chair of the Board of a charity called PAMIS, which supports people with profound and multiple learning disabilities and their families and carers. I'm Louise Morgan, and I'm the Director for Carers Trust Scotland in Northern Ireland. I'm delighted to be here to present the award for Family Carer and Relative. There was very clear evidence of the carer's actions and support having an incredibly positive impact on the family member. And I was really struck by the impressive efforts made to enhance the understanding of PMLD with wonderful films on a whole range of topics which are shared on social media and I'd highly recommend anyone to watch them. So I'm really pleased to be able to say that we have an outstanding winner of the Family Carer and their Relative Award to celebrate this year. As you know we have some outstanding finalists this year but the winner of the award goes to Shazad, Shazad and Wali and Ahmed. Ahmed. Congratulations to you both. Assalamu alaikum from me.
me, Shazad, and from Walid. I am Walid's older brother. Walid, Walid. Say assalamu alaikum to everyone. Assalamu alaikum from Walid. And today I'm going to show you how to use the lift. Today I'm going to talk about a very important matter. So today I'm going to talk specifically about Walid. So Walid has epilepsy, cerebral palsy, and he is also registered blind. So me and my parents, we are unpaid caterers for Walid. My videos are usually about things that we do with Walid. For example, we take him out for walks. There's a video on us taking Walid to different parks. I've also made a video on why having a electrical bed is very important, not just for Walid, also for the caterers as well. Uh, you're able to move the bed up and this can prevent the caterer from having back injuries. And I've made a video on why it's important to brush teeth of people with special needs. So I was born in a village in Pakistan and I had a really big family. And when my father brought me a brush and a toothpaste, people in my family, they started to laugh at me. And so I was discouraged from brushing my teeth. When I was eight years old, I had many of my teeth taken out. And people like my brother, their teeth need to be brushed more regularly. So today I'm going to show you in my video of how I brush my brother's teeth. And the main aim for my videos are so that other people can take information, advice as well, of how to take care of people with special needs. And in some developing countries, those kind of informations are not available. When I put them on YouTube and Facebook, people from all over the world can access it. And I've been receiving very positive comments as well. Walid really motivated me to study medicine. I was first going to move by myself, but then I thought that Walid would be really upset and it's going to affect his health as well. So my father, he sacrificed his job and my mom as well. So we all moved to Aberdeen so that Walid and me could be together and so that Walid is happy. Thank you for liking my videos and following my page. Remember me and my brother in your prayers and see you in next video. Thank you very much for watching our video and it's always good to have a big dream because when we started this YouTube channel we were trying to get a few 10 20 people and now Alhamdulillah we have nearly 600 subscribers so it's always good to have a big dream and we want to spread awareness to other families and caters. Thanks.